Hello, this is Lisa Farm Brilliance, and today I would like to talk to you a little bit about this project that we have on the Brilliance website. In our project blog, you can find free designs like this one that we have here. The link to this particular design can be found in the description of this video. It happens to be an adorable heart with two names that can be enveloped into this heart shape. And I'm going to pop into the software to show you how easy it is to create a personalized design using the Embrilliance platform. The first thing we have here is an empty design page and we'll click on the merge stitch file to browse to the location on our computer where we have downloaded and unzipped the file from the project blog. When we select it and click import, it automatically populates the design page and you can notice that there are now components in the object pane here on the right. Let's click on the plus sign or disclosure triangle of the design at the top list here to see the components of this enveloped design. Envelope number one is the shape that will contain the lettering object that you want to put at the top name. Envelope number two corresponds to the shape of the lettering at the bottom of this heart. The two lettering objects shown here in the display pane are, have the same numbers. So letters one corresponds to envelope one and letters two matches envelope number two. When you click on the lettering object, a couple things happen. First of all, your properties pane will change into the letter properties pane. The second thing to notice is that the, the text becomes single line. It removes the envelope so that you can edit the text and see what it looks like normally. So to change the text here, you'll want to select it and change it into something else. Make sure you spell it correctly and hit the enter key on your keyboard. Notice that in the display pane, the name has, has changed to what it is that you have typed. Now, I happen to be using Hobo font. This is part of font collection number two. If you do not have the font collection number two installed on your computer, you'll see a different font name here from your list. So you can, you're, it will not update to a font if you do not have that font installed. You can, if you are using any of the Embrilliance platform programs, you will always have block font. So to see it automatically change, if you don't have Hobo, change it to block. You'll see the text change into the font that you have selected. And when you click off of it, it will automatically update into the font that you have chosen. So make sure you have chosen a font that is installed on your computer. Those of you that have Essentials can use any of the built-in Essentials fonts as well as any Stitch-based BX fonts that you happen to have installed, such as this one from Jolson's Designs. So the key points here is to select the lettering text, type in the name that you want and hit the Enter key, click off of the selection and it'll automatically morph into the shape that is set for the envelopes. For more information about envelopes and creating them yourself or using the programs, please visit our YouTube channel that is listed here. And thank you so much for spending some time with me today learning about how to customize this sweetheart design in the Embrilliance platform.